Hey everyone, and welcome to another custom challenge run in the Binding of Isaac. A lot of you may be wondering, why so many custom challenge runs? Actually, I figure probably none of you are wondering that, because uh, I mean, most of you like them more. But don't worry, the Let's Play will be coming back as soon as I feel like um, switching my save files out. Honestly, I've just been too lazy to open Dropbox to get my save back. Uh, so I just haven't been playing Let's Play, and I've just been enjoying custom challenge runs a lot. Anyway, you see by the fact that we're at the menu, that today we have a very special challenge uh, that's, you know, kind of kind of an easy challenge, sort of. But it's not going to be easy at all, I promise. Uh, I'm also going to be uploading two challenge runs today because they're very similar, essentially the same. Uh, so you'll see one about an hour, and a, or well, an hour after this one, I'd say, and then the Ratchet and Clank video will come later. Uh, we're not going to see three videos a day very often, but today's an exception. So uh, what we're going to have is, uh, oh, this is coming to us from Codlova again. I don't know if that, that happened last time, but it happened at some point, so it's again. Uh, and he called it the head, but I'm going to call it Ego. And a lot of you probably already know what it is. Um, I'm just calling it Ego because the next one will go with it, essentially. Anyway, um, I have it on already. I'm getting an, a large odd mushroom every room. And so every room, my head will get a little bit larger. I'll get a little bit stronger, and uh, my health will increase by one, but that doesn't really matter because it's not filled. Uh, yeah, I'll take this damage up, and of course, I want to complete the game as fast as possible because soon I won't be able to tell where my body is or anything. And by the way, I'll be giving this a couple of tries because, I mean, there's no way that I'm making it work. Ooh, excellent. Cancer is uh, doubles our fire, fire rate. Anyway, uh, essentially, I just want to complete everything as fast as possible. Uh, note that my speed also goes down one every time I get one of these odd mushrooms, but I don't know if there's a lower cap for speed. Uh, so health health is very important, because at this point, I'm no longer, well, I'm just barely able to see my body. And my body is where the hitbox is. They can walk through my head all they want, and it won't bother me. But if they touch my body, I'm screwed. But our damage gonna be increasing every room so that's good and uh, <laughs> other than that not much is good because our health doesn't fill as it increases and you know nothing nothing's going too well except damage but damage is good and uh, squeezy that's tears up and two soul hearts the soul hearts are helpful and of course those are the only rules that we just can't um, we just have to get uh, the thing every time. Uh, yeah, no, no. <laughs> and it's not really worth it to come back because each time I'm just gonna get a bigger head and it'll just be harder to see. So it's just not happening. I'm not going back to reroll it again. It got its one chance and now I'm headed to the boss, hopefully. I don't know how far I should make it. Like, I really, I have no clue what to expect for, um, longevity. I, like, wasn't even sure how well placed that bomb was, so... You know, we're we're just we're just gonna, gonna do this because I gotta do it at one point. You know, every YouTube Let's Player does this challenge if he's playing Binding of Isaac and uh, doing challenge runs, of course. It's just something you gotta do. It's like a rite of passage. I didn't pick up that key. <laughs> okay, I have no idea where my body is relative to everything else. Uh, I have no money for you, Mr. Beggar. So we're just gonna ignore you. Oh, oops. I thought that I'd walk through the door, so I pressed space to skip. So we're just gonna we're just gonna deal with with whatever item we get, unless I just really don't want it. We're gonna get a soul heart from this because uh, it's Blue Air Junior, and we get a health up. Health up is excellent. Uh, the deal with the Devil Room is totally worth it if there's something I want. Uh, you know what, Spirit of the Night, super valuable. Oh God, I'm terrifying. <laughs> All right, so now I have flight and spectral tears, which is gonna help with maneuverability. But oh my God, look at me! When my <laughs> face gets to be the whole screen large, this is terrifying. Look at my teeth. <laughs> but uh, we don't have to worry about where we are on the stage for shooting people, so that's good. Uh, I'm just gonna go straight to the boss. My damage is fine, so that's not a problem see what we got in here. What did we got? Oh, God. Oh, no. Yep, had to take a hit there. It was hard not to. 
But I haven't been taking much damage, which is good. Okay, okay, we, we, we got this. Again, great damage. Every time we get one, we're going to increase our damage a little bit. So that's the trade-off, as long as, as long as we're doing well here. Oh, we're going to pick up a cube of meat here. There's nothing I can do about that. I can't re-roll it. It won't matter. As long as we can pick it up. And uh, actually, that's going to be excellent, because it's going to sort of um, tell us where our body is. Okay, this is going to be difficult, by the way. But as long as we can see the cube of meat, which we can for about half of its rotation, uh, we know where our body is because it rotates around our body, not around any particular amount of our head or anything. So that's actually super helpful. Okay, so we got a lump of coal, but I'm going to re-roll it for the common cold. Because a lump of coal is a damage increase based on how far our tears travel, but we have plenty of damage. I'm not worried about that. Whereas common cold, or whatever else we might have gotten, well, common cold at least, that gives us poison damage. Oh god, I can't see the enemies at the top of the screen. Oh god, I didn't kill him. I, I thought there was an explosive uh, death there. Oh god. So, this room, at least, is uh, a curse. Anyway, common cold gives us poison damage when our shots hit sometimes. And something else may have done, you know, something else great. Anyway, I'm just trying to find the bosses as quickly as possible. Get away from there. Okay, we're good. Oh god, I can't see him. It's faster than me, I'm sure of it. Oh, look at me. I am a freaking monster. <laughs> oh, for once this room isn't guaranteed damage. I don't want to be there. I want to be up. As long as I can stay near the top of the screen, I have a chance. But at some point, I'm just not going to be able to see the screen. So I won't have a chance. Alright, so this was a bad path. That means we've essentially gotten twice as much head size as we would have because we went the wrong way. So we have to go all the way back, not fighting rooms, just increasing the size of our head. Oh my god, look at me. <laughs> this couldn't have gone better from that standpoint. Oh god, I can't find the door. Are you too fat to get through the door? I am. Okay, I don't know where you guys are, leapers. Uh, worry not, I'm not worried, I'm not worried. Alright. And I'm really, really slow. Okay, we got that bomb, as far as I can tell. At least we're super strong. I don't know how well the uh, other Let's Players that are big that have done this that I may have seen. I don't know how well they did, but I, you know, I'm not confident about doing better. You know, I like to imagine, yeah, I'm better than them. I'm smarter at this game. I know more about it. But oh god, it's the fast chub too. This is hopeless. I don't know where. Oh god. <laughs> Chubb, one of the worst bosses we could fight here. And, uh, you know, I don't think I could do better. I mean, maybe I will, maybe I won't. I was planning on doing a couple runs of this, but it looks like that the first run will last long enough to um, be good. I don't need another tears up. Yeah, health up and uh, half a heart recovery, that's what I want. So, yeah, I'm skipping item rooms, but really, what more do I need? I have max health, I have tons and tons of damage. So I really just, I don't see why, why it really matters uh, if I go to item rooms. Okay, you're dead. You're dead. If we find the shop on our travels, oh, did I already get it? Okay, never mind. I thought we would have 15 cents there, but we, we do not. So maybe if we find the shop in our travels, then we'll go, but not unless I find another cent. That probably would have hit me. I think it hit the cube of meat. So basically what I'm finding is uh, my body is a little higher up than I think it is. Like, my, my chin seems to still be around uh, good judgment for where my body is. Oh, God. Health. The health is important. See, I'm doing pretty well with that. Better than at least some of the ones I've watched did. But, you know, picking things up is what I was talking about. Uh, we also pretty much take damage in the start of a few rooms, pretty much guaranteed, just because, oh my god, I don't know where my tears are coming from. Oh no. Oh no, this is not the situation to be in. Circle strafing, not the best right now. Uh, but what I was saying, we I have no idea where the tears are coming out relative to um, <laughs> anything. Alright, we got Monstro 2. Apply the Pro Strat. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Monstro 2, where have you gone? <laughs> He's on a rock. That's that's good to know. Why aren't you shooting at me? 
Shoot your laser. Please shoot your laser. Okay. He died. We didn't take a hit. We've got health up and damage up. And we've got a little more health. And we're going to get a health up from the Eternal Heart. Doesn't really matter. That's why I took it. Oh, where's... where's... Okay. There's the trap door. Oh my god. Okay, we're fighting Chubb again. But this time... This time I'll be the last laugh. Oh, I'm shooting tears really fast. Okay, so that one was easy because of the rocks. I did get that, okay. Uh, yeah, I, it's totally not worth it. I would love for it to be t worth it, but no. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was worth it, because I don't know if that did a half heart or a full heart, but regardless, we got a full heart, so I'm totally cool with it. Oh my god, my head's so big. Oh no, we've gone the wrong way. It's always a catastrophe. Oh, uh, nope, nope. Look at me. <laughs> I really hope that that's the thumbnail for this. <laughs> Just <some laughs> it's, that's horrible. Oh god, no, not the wrong way again. But yeah, I really hope that like this very moment is the thumbnail. It's beautiful. Or at least one of the options for the thumbnail, so I can pick it. Uh, no, we want to be higher. Oh man. So this is around where uh, everyone starts failing. Okay, we'll kill him one day. All right, we good there? Oh no, nope. Okay, we got hit anyway. May as well pop this chest for a range up. I could have, should have re-rolled it, but whatever. Okay, we found the boss. This is Necropolis Two. So we're fighting the boss. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> at least, at least our shots are just tanking, mom. Oh, got hit. And I think that the nicest part is that... Oh, that's why things didn't happen, because you don't die. Uh, we want the Polaroid. And we don't need another range up, that's for sure. We do want a health up, because we can't reroll again, and because it does recover a heart for us. So, uh, we've made it. Our head is almost bigger than the room. And I've been having a pretty large success just going left every time. Okay, you died. It sounded like a chest dropped, and the chest did indeed drop. The stars takes us to the item room. Let's just use it as a teleport, because that's what it is. And it took us the opposite way. Well, I'm going to roll with it. It's funny, because it looks like we're throwing our uh, tears in an arc. Like they're going up and then coming back down. I don't really know what to say about that. Uh, here we're fighting the hollow that I can't really see. So that's nice. It's nice getting hit just because we start blinking a little bit so that we can see the stage. Uh, would you drop a key? Sure. Uh, up more. Okay. Good. Oh no. The stars led us astray. Which sounds kind of cool. Because it could have other meanings. Oh my god, it really does look like we're lobbing our tears like up into the air, but they actually hit things. It's it's disconcerting. I bet left was the right way. But we'll see. Soon, I suppose. Ah. I don't like situations. See, that, that you just kind of have to take damage in some situations. Oh, almost had to there. That's for sure. Uh, yeah, why isn't that hitting you? Well, this is awkward. Die, please. Thank you. Yeah, so it's getting harder just because of how our tears are acting now. Yeah, let's pop it. Tammy's head, let's re-roll it. Poison bombs, sure, why not? Of course, we won't have a re-roll for the boss, but the boss is conquest, and it'll be white pony. That means we could have re-rolled it if we had... I mean, this looks kind of cool, <laughs> but we could have re-rolled it if we had had uh, the D6. Yeah, over the rock. Over the rock see half of my chin, basically. And my awesome, awesome teeth. Uh, at least Conquest is far easier than usual due to the fact that um, we have a ton of damage and he's not attacking much. Nope, now you did. We certainly don't need the pony. We just wanted that health. The white pony, that is. Let's go down. I've been doing pretty well. Oh my god. I have no idea where anything is. Oh. 
I don't know if we're gonna get hit or not. I can't tell. I need to shoot from above. <laughs> it's the only way to play. Okay, so, uh, I mean, this is going incredibly well, I want to say. I don't know how long it'll keep going incredibly well. And I have a feeling that uh, when I do the um, complimentary run that's coming in an hour or so, it will not go super amazingly well like this one has. This room will go fine, though. Although, I don't want to, you know, act like I'm going to win this run. I might, I probably won't. Because I just, I mean, have you seen what I look like and how hard it is to navigate through life? <laughs> My head is their background. But Envy, Envy is easy just because of high damage and rocks with flight. Flight was good. We could have made any deal with the devil we wanted. Just because of the fact that we have um, all the health we could imagine. Like, I have so many, so many hearts that aren't hearts. Because, like, you can't have more than 12 red hearts, but you can have um, more than 12 tradable hearts. So, like, a deal with the devil would take these uh, hearts that I've been accumulating before it took um, the 12 that I have here that are health. But I, if I filled up to 12 hearts right now, that would be max health. That's what I'm getting at. Okay, you guys are dying. Okay, two hits. Okay, okay. I'm nervous. Oh no, this is not where I want to be. Okay, okay. We're making this work. It's just so difficult to aim. And I don't remember seeing this in the other videos that I watched. Oh my god, the game. It's like lagging because I'm so freaking huge. And I definitely no longer fit in a room. My head is unbelievable. But I think that this is a... Oh my god. <laughs> this is an area of strategy I have that the other Let's Players that I've watched didn't. Is I'm sticking to the top of the room. It's the only place I know is safe for me. So that's where I'm staying. And they didn't do that. They wandered about the room having no idea what was safe and what was not. But I'm about to die. I just uh, figured you guys might not notice for whatever reason. Uh, okay, so there's a heart. There's a heart. That's equivalent to one full heart of recovery. Good, we found the boss. Okay, I can also fire right when I'm up here. Oh, okay, 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 it's okay. Where are you gonna be? Where are you gonna be? Now you're dead. Half heart, do not want. Okay, so if we can win this fight, I consider this a success. Okay, gotta be to the left though, or the right. It's because that's the easiest way to do anything in this fight. Because you're the furthest away. God, I'm flinging the tears high. Oh no. Okay, I have no idea how I'm going to dodge this. It's just going to be luck. Okay, monster is dead. We're doing a ton of damage, and that's that's half the battle. Knights might be impossible. Like, they just... I don't... Oh, good. Common cold. Oh, I just got hit, apparently. But common cold, very valuable due to the fact that that can damage them through their skulls, through whatever they, their armor. So we don't have to worry about getting behind them to do that stuff. Okay, so we got this going for us. Uh, got hit there. Do we win? We have Polaroid Invincibility, which you can see by that little circle there. And we won! Okay, um, I didn't actually... Ooh, 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 ooh. That means we can get another heart at the cost of a slightly larger head. And then we go up to the cathedral and see what we can do. I don't remember if anyone else got to the cathedral that I've seen do this challenge. So I'm just going to go ahead and call that a personal victory in that regard. Uh, death will probably be our death. But yeah, the de there's, there's no chance. Oh no. Yeah, okay, I could not judge where that was. So we just had a ton of odd mushrooms and then some tears up, so it went pretty well. So that was the eager run. 
yeah, I, I'm, you know, I'm happy with how that went. I had fun, and that's gonna be it for this video. I'll see you guys in like an hour with another Isaac video. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.